This is really Swedish melancholy as it's raised to be sitting outside in the chilly weather. A successful business sparks from an idea, a passion. In four episodes, we'll meet entrepreneurs and inventors to find out what they've learned during the process of starting their own ventures. Welcome to Peeps. I'm here with Alexander Stutterheim, who made a name in the fashion world with a new take on his grandfather's old raincoat. Well, my name is Alexander Stutterheim, and I'm the founder and creative director at Stutterheim Raincoats, uh, which initially was an antidepressant uh, hobby project a couple of years ago, but now it's a well, we are trying to become an international fashion brand within rain. Totally accidentally, I, I found my granddad's old fisherman's coat in a barn outside Stockholm, in, a, in the Stockholm archipelago. He had recently passed away, so we went through his stuff and, and on a wall, on a, on a nail, it was hanging. And I decided to buy one when I got back to Stockholm, but I couldn't find him. And initially I just wanted to make black raincoats. And I said to myself, I, I would rather quit this project and make colorful raincoats. But I now have 11 <laughs> colors, so I, one can change. So these are uh, letters that I wrote initially on a typewriter, a vintage typewriter. I have small letters um, that I hide inside each pocket. But it feels like you're born into the wrong decade because everything is so <laughs> well done. <laughs> Perhaps sometimes I actually think that myself. I wanted to do something slow because I have been running for the, my full life. So I wanted something, or my shrink wanted me to actually to have a, a slow scale project. Do you have a calmer life now? No, but a much more fun. Moi! Mä oon Pyry Catchbox-nimisestä startupista Suomesta Helsingistä. Suodessaan Catchbox on ihan normaali mikrofoni. Uh, se on pehmeä, näkyy. Se on hyvin heitettävä, tosi kevyt ja se on värikäs. Niitä voidaan tehdä eri väreissä. Moi moi! What are the three elements of success according to you? If you have to have a very passion-driven uh, ID uh, and vision what you want to accomplish. You need a good uh, accountant to keep track of uh, finances, which I didn't have the first two years. And you need to have a good shrink <laughs> that can handle all your uh, neurosis. It's very stressful to, to know that you don't make any money out of it because it takes time. But eventually if you stick to your concept and develop it and have good people working with you, you, you might succeed. But it's a, it's a war. Previously in my life I have had ideas, didn't have the time or the energy or the, the guts. But for this one I really decided that I should go from A to Z without getting tired. And that I can see that I have actually succeeded with. Me and my shrink are very proud of that. <laughs> Something from Barnes. I hope it's a gift. Where would you like to sell your clothes? My dream would be to have own rain shops. That's my megalomania ID. There are surfer shops all over the world. Why, why can't there be rain shops? And this is, a, I'm really interested. I'm doing a cape and we have had it in black and now we have a sample in red. You can try it if you want. Right. It, it have, have no sleeves, it just leans on your shoulders. I'm ready to meet the wolf. <laughs> Actually, I think it was a nice color. I think it should be like a couple of centimeters longer. I like it. Next time, join me on a surfing adventure at a brand new high-end hotel in Peniche, Portugal. I started surfing because I had a dream when I was 12 years old that I was surfing.